Wearing their products shows that you endorse their message. Now give them here. I'll be down in the lab, and I'm taking these smoochies with me. Well, that was a bust. Guess I'm gonna get kicked out of student council. Again. Come on, let's drown our sorrow with some good old space tow truck. It's your turn to make the popcorn blossom. Okay. Hmm. Ooh, thanks to those Powerpuff Girls, Smojis are trending big time. Everything is going just as planned. Now's the time to use the selfie scepter to enact our plan and build our fan base. So anyway, like I was saying, I told her. You're gonna pay for those, right? Fashionistas. Fashionistas. See you next week for another episode of Space Tow Truck. Hey, did you ever notice how Space Cat and Cat Kent are never in the same place at the same time? Oh man, you gotta check out this fanfic I wrote about that. Breaking news! The fashionistas are turning Townsville into a glamorous metropolis of glamour. And this reporter loves it. Now here's Bob with the five-day forecast. The fashionistas are hot, hot, hot. Back to you, Nick. They sure are, Bob. Let's hear what the fashionistas have to say. Finally, we're the celebrities we were always meant to be, Barbie. And with that selfie scepter, they can get anything they want. Attention, Attention followers. Your marvelous idols have some requests. Bring us a non-fat almond milk skinny double chai latte. Why, thank you. Totally hot, Nick. <clears throat> we desire all of Townsville's diamonds, even the tiny ones. Well, diamonds are a girl's best friend, and with their new Powerpuff Girl bodyguard, they're unstoppable. Awesome! What? That reversible turncoat? I can't believe she went back and put on her smoji. What? Blossom put on a smoji after I specifically told her not to? <laughs> Girls, get in the car. We're going to get your sister. Uh, are you sure you don't want us to fly? No. There are some things a dad just has to do. <laughs> Stay in the car, girls. Don't worry, Professor. We're right behind. Car! Excuse me. Make way. I have to speak with my daughter. Awesome. Who's that tacky milkman? <laughs> Look here. Don't give me that blank stare, young lady. I have specifically asked you to take that smoochie off two times now. Oh, I'm very disappointed in you. Uh-oh. He's given her the finger whack disappointed stare combo. She's doomed! As long as you live under my roof, you have to follow my rules. Oh, this is getting old fast. Blossom, shoo this milkman away, will you? And furthermore, <laughs> Blossom! Professor! Are you sure you don't want us to... Stay in the car. We can take her on. Stay in the car. Professor! Car! All right, I've had just about enough of- Ah, uh, give it a rest. You! You're the bad influence on my daughters. Oh, man, he's going full dad. Stop manipulating my daughter. Stay back, you outdated poser. Ah, he's got our selfie scepter. Fashion police. Looks like you're out of glamour. And into the slammer. Ah! <coughs> hmm. Okay, finished. I pulled out all the weeds, cleaned the gutters, and washed the car. Can we get out of the car now? No. Because we're going out for ice cream. And so once again, the day is saved. Thanks to Professor Utonium and the power of good parenting. <laughs>